Hi, I'm Lee. And I'm Morten. And we're LEGO Designers. In this video, we'll show you that it is easy to edit the programs in the activities and make the robots do what you want them to do. We will take a look at two models and modify them in different ways. We'll look at Jello and Tricky. Let's begin by looking at Jello. Here's the second activity with the Jello model. Mission ready. Let's see what it does before editing it. There are six blocks, but you don't need to edit all of them. The first Jello model block sets up his speed. You can make Jello go faster or slower by changing the value here. Should we go faster? Let's go faster. We can make Jello move backwards by changing the drop down for direction. It has four options forward, backwards, left, or right. Let's do backwards and change it to 2 seconds. The activity shows you a reduced palette of the blocks you need. Let's bring in another Jello walk block so it can move forward right after moving backward. Your program should look like this and you can test it by pressing play. Let's get some practice editing that second block to see how Jello behaves turning. How many seconds does it take for Jello to turn about 90 degrees on your surface? Now, let's take a look at Tricky's Drawing Robot activity. First, let's see what it does before editing the program. Tricky draws a square. So let's see if we can make it draw some other patterns the easiest of which is a circle. First, let's move the part where it draws a square. Click and drag the repeat block off of the program so it sits by itself on the canvas. We'll need to see the rest of the blocks to do this. So let's click on the Activity button under the Blocks palette and click on the Mindstorms option. Let's add a block to bring Tricky's pen down. We'll go to the movement blocks and drag in a move straight zero for 10 centimeters. Let's change the straight to left minus 60. You can type it in or drag the wheel to the left when you click on the straight. We can then change the duration from seven to 80 centimeters. And last, a block to bring the pen up. Set up the robot on a piece of paper, a nice big one, and play the program. You can change more blocks and parameters to make the robots do what you want, but it's always great to get started with some ideas. Keep playing and inventing. Thank you for watching.